Hi, my name is Melissa Bullard. I'm the payroll manager for APM, and I wanted to talk today about how I encourage CBS as a team member as well as a people leader. In the payroll department, the way that we keep uh, safety and CBS commitments uh, in the conversation is that every month when we have our payroll meeting, we have a standing line item on our agenda for CBS discussions, and sometimes the discussion might be someone sharing their current CBS commitments, their progress, their challenges, any setbacks they've faced, um, and the successes that they've had, or it could be someone sharing a story that happened to them outside of work or in the office where something that they hadn't thought about previously, a situation came up, how they were able to handle it from a safety perspective, um, which is really great for the whole team because then that provides us the opportunity to kind of think outside our normal day-to-day, -day, um, you know, routines and be more aware of any safety concerns that might present themselves in the office or just out and about in our lives. Uh, the other thing that I wanted to mention is the importance of safety for office workers as well as in the field. Um, while in the office we don't have the same challenges that field employees have, we do have things that we have to be very um, aware of and concerned about and safety is, is very important for us to keep on our minds every day as we come into the office or work in our home offices. Um, sometimes we might even have more challenges in our home office than we do in the uh, corporate office. So um, it's just super important to keep that conversation going um, within your team, your coworkers, and um, just keep safety first. So um, the question I want to leave you with today is what task has CBS most helped you improve from a safety standpoint? And on that note, I want to thank you for your time today and stay safe out there.